Man, I'd want to be the guy in the back so bad. important thing to talk about. So you know how I've been really good. I haven't done any kind of paid sponsorships. I haven't done any shout outs to companies or anything. I would change that in a second if someone paid me enough money so I can afford that. Like, I would shill. I would be a total shill for a Cybertruck. I already know what I'm walking into, but you don't. What the heck? Burner tubes are shit. Try replacing this. That sounded a lot better in my head. Look at this. All brand new. Can you believe I had all this on the truck? Pfft, I'm the best technician ever. I'm totally joking. Of course, I had to go to the supply shop to get it. Okay, got everything installed, ready to go. Take a look at this. Man. That's why it was shut off. It's freaking leaking. Okay, so while I'm here, I'm gonna run it. Maybe when it heats up, the sections will expand together and stop the leak. Um, if not, the bottom's just gonna let go. So fingers crossed, they expand together. through and oh shit damn okay now oh my god that's low There we go. It's gotta be jumped out somewhere. Okay, I know this seems like a cop out, but. My headlight died and it's too dark back there to really get anything good to see. So I'll just let you know what happens. Okay, here's what you missed. So, when I went to restart everything, nothing happened. Checked power across the number 67 and the 51-2, and the 67 was one with the power problem. So, I filled the boiler up, I just bypassed it, filled it up, and took the plugs off the cross tees, and took like a, I don't even know what it was. And I just pushed down on them. They were definitely stuck, loosened them up, uh, you know, was able to flush all the water and, and all the mud out, put the plugs back in, turn everything back on. Still didn't light. No filling either from the 51-2. So I knew there was a pile of mud in the bottom. It was gonna be so difficult to try and clean it from the bottom like I did with the number 67. Close it up. 
And once I did that, refilled on its own and the boiler kicked on. I'm gonna sit here for a couple more minutes. Just keep an eye on the section to make sure it's not leaking like crazy. But this is, I think, where I'm gonna end it. What a great way to end the video. Uh, see you tomorrow.